as befits a flagship, Audi A8 accumulates all the latest achievements of the company. This applies to both the technical component of the car and its onboard electricians, as well as various security systems and driver assistance. All this, of course, is great, but with age, all these technical delicacies and electronic gadgets start to mope, spinning the owners for unplanned diagnostics and repairs. Audi A8 of the first generation was born in 1994. The G8, which became the company's first model with an aluminum body, lasted eight years on the assembly line. Audi A8 of the second generation debuted in 2002. Just like its predecessor, the sedan was produced with both full and front-wheel drive, and the car could be either with a normal or with an extended wheelbase. Audi A8 third generation since 2010. Therefore, if you are aiming for a used in Galantad 8, do not chase fancy modifications that are a priori expensive to maintain, take simpler versions, this will significantly save your budget. For example, if offered a choice of a petrol turbocharged V8 or even a W12 versus a more modest 3.0 liter turbo diesel version, we recommend the latter. Let such an A8 lose a lot in terms of dynamics, but it is less expensive to maintain. By the way, our A8 was officially sold with a 3.0 liter V6 petrol, 290 horsepower, a 4.2 liter V8, 372 horsepower, and even a 6.3 liter W12 with a capacity of 500 horses. Turbo diesels were represented by 3.0 liter V6 outputs of 204 and 250 horsepower as well as a 4.1 liter V8 with 350 horsepower. Since 2013, instead of a 4.2 liter gasoline aspirated, turbo 8 with a volume of 4.0 liters and a capacity of 420 horses has appeared. After retailing in 2014, all power units have become noticeably more powerful. Petrol V8 4.2 engine is a priori reliable. True, after 150,000 kilometers, Active engine mounts usually get tired, converters and oxygen sensors, spark plugs and ignition coils ask for rest. A supercharged version with a volume of 4.0 liters is more capricious in operation, mainly due to the turbocharger, the service life of which is on average 170,000 kilometers. At the base 290 horsepower, 6, by this time, the turbine also begins to wet and sweat, from 50,000 rubles, the EGR valve becomes unusable it must be cleaned periodically, and the timing chain can stretch earlier than its 200,000 kilometers. To replace, you need to remove or hang out the engine, so the procedure will require a minimum of 35,000 rubles. At risk are also engine mounts, from 9,000 rubles, a generator and a water pump, 17,000 rubles. But V6 turbo diesels are a model of reliability. Children's sores, if they were, have already been cured. If you use standard fuel and oil, it can run up to 700,000 kilometers before overhaul. True, during this time you will have to change the glow plugs, 5,500 rubles each, injection nozzles, 18,500 rubles each, and the booster fuel pump, 60,000 rubles. Inversions with volumetric W-shaped motors are best avoided. Troublesome and expensive. The ZF automatic transmission is reliable, and the key to its longevity is an oil change every 60 to 80,000 kilometers. True control electronics can fool, which is usually treated by flashing the software. There are no complaints about the 4x4 transmission either. When choosing modifications with their suspension, remember that its expensive elements take care of a maximum of 200,000 kilometers. After that, the burden of expenses will fall on your shoulders. Modifications The sedan with the letter L in the corporate index differs from the regular A8 with the wheelbase increased by 130 millimeters. All the extra free space fell on the rear of the cabin. The charged version of $8 was equipped with a petrol 4.0 liter turbocharged V8 with 520 horsepower. She was exclusively all-wheel drive. After restyling, an updated version of the Esky appeared with a 605 horsepower engine. Transmission The Audi A8 uses a permanent all-wheel drive system with a transfer case integrated into the automatic transmission case and a self-locking differential that distributes torque in a ratio of 40 colon 60 in favor of the rear axle. By the way, the durability of the transmission directly depends on the frequency of changing the oil in the machine. Engine The best choice for a used A8 is a modification with a 3.0 liter turbo diesel. He is reputed to be trouble-free and can run up to 700,000 kilometers and even more. But during this time, 
you will have to change the glow plugs, 5,500 rubles each, injection nozzles, 18,500 rubles each, and the booster fuel pump, 60,000 rubles. Suspension. The durability of the undercarriage directly depends on the driving style and the quality of the road surface. However, some details have to be changed due to the design. For example, on the second generation AB, the levers are made of aluminum alloy. Therefore, when silent blocks and ball bearings are worn, these consumables have to be updated along with the levers. Body. Advanced technologies have affected not only the A8 units, but also the body. It consists entirely of light alloys. Even the power structure of the body is made of aluminum and its alloys, and all the load-bearing hinged elements of the body are also aluminum. So, you understand, there is simply nothing to rust here. Electric. The door locks and power windows are periodically buggy, the MMI multimedia the moping, the keyless entry and start-stop system, the engine and automatic transmission electronics fail. These faults are floating. The defect disappears after restarting the engine or removing the terminals from the battery. Pros and cons. Plus reliable diesels, corrosion-resistant body, durable automatic transmission, excellent dynamics and driving properties. Problematic gasoline engines, capricious electronics, high cost of repairs, 